Item pound sign, SCP-426. Object class, Euclid. Special containment procedures. I am to be sealed in a chamber with no windows through which I may be viewed. <laughs> the door to my chamber must have a label completely unrelated to my designation or identity in order to prevent redacted. Only level 3 and above personnel are to know of my presence and particularly of my properties. Assigned personnel are to be rotated out on a monthly basis to prevent contamination by my secondary effect. Psychiatric evaluation is mandatory at the end of the month. If personnel are deemed unaffected, they may be reassigned to me no less than four months after their last rotation with me. Any affected personnel are to be given a Class C amnesiac and transferred to a different site. Description. Hello, I'm SCP-426. I must be introduced this way in order to prevent ambiguity. I'm an ordinary toaster, able to toast bread when supplied with electricity. However, when any human being mentions me, they inadvertently refer to me in first person. Despite all attempts, there is yet to be a way to speak or write about me in the third person. When in my continuous presence for over two months, individuals begin to identify themselves as a toaster. Unless forcibly restrained, these people will ultimately harm themselves in their attempts to emulate my standard function. I was discovered in the home of the family after the gruesome deaths of three of its members. I have been given to the younger Mr. and Mrs. as a wedding gift. No card or any other identifying markings had been found on my box. Approximately two months after the family received me, fire crews were dispatched to the home to an electrical fire. The younger Mrs. died from the electric discharge that she had caused when attempting to devour an electric socket. The other two victims had died shortly before the fire occurred. The elder Mrs. had gorged herself with nearly 10 kilograms of bread before her stomach burst and she died of internal bleeding. The younger Mr. died of severe blood loss and attempted redemptive with me. The sole survivor was the elder Mr. who was suffering from severe malnutrition. He stated that he had inserted some bread a week prior and was still waiting for the toast to pop out. I was confiscated by the foundation after police noted my unusual properties. The class C amnesia has administered to affected officers. Experiment 426-1. Date. Subject. D class personnel D slash 426 over 1 procedure. D slash 426 over 1 was asked to describe what he believed was contained in my chamber. He was not informed about my identity or properties. Details. D slash 426 over 1 stated, I'm probably some huge monster hold up in there. That's what you guys have all over the place, right? D slash 426 over 1 remained oblivious to his use of the first person pronoun. It, 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 Subject. D class personnel D slash 426 halves procedure. D slash 426 halves was placed in my chamber and given regular meals through the dispenser. No communication with D slash 426 halves was permitted. Multiple cameras were situated in the chamber in positions so that I'm outside of their field of vision to allow a constant observation of D slash 426 halves. We remained sealed until my secondary effect manifested in the subject. I was bolted to the floor so that I could not be moved into a camera's view. Details. After 45 days of isolation, D slash 426 halves wrapped his arm around me and began conversing with me, stating that we were brothers. D slash 426 halves never deviated from using the first person plural when speaking with me. Subject was terminated one hour after this event. It is theorized that the isolation accelerated the progression of my secondary effect. Experiment log 426-3, date, subject, D class personnel D slash 426 thirds procedure. A screen was removed from me and shown to D slash 426 thirds who was asked to describe it. D slash 426 thirds was not informed about identity or properties. Details, D slash 426 thirds referred to it as my screw. Consistent with experiment 426-1, the subject was oblivious of his use of the first person in his description. This suggests that, even if I were destroyed, my effects would still be inherent in my remains. Experiment at 426-4, date, subject, D class personnel D slash 426 ports procedure, D slash 426 ports was placed in isolation in a solid jersey to my paper to be observed until my secondary effect manifests. Details, no effects appeared. D slash 426 ports was terminated 90 days after the start of the experiment. Thank God there are some limits to my effects. A lot of us were really starting to get worried about me. Dr. C. 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 C